The Alpha Centauri star system is four light years from Earth, our nearest galactic neighbor. A privately funded venture called Breakthrough Starshot has a plan to send human technology there in the next few decades. To do that, the first interstellar spaceship will have to be extremely light and extremely fast. Pete Warden, the former head of NASA's Ames Lab, now leads the Starshot project. Well, the real question that we've got is, is there life elsewhere? Uh, are there other Earths? In Starshot's master plan, which could take flight two decades from now, a mothership orbiting Earth will launch a tiny probe called a nanocraft. The nanocraft will carry data-gathering electronics on a one-way mission to the Alpha Centauri system. Once outside the mothership, the nanocraft will inflate a spherical sail. Next, an Earth-based laser array will fire a tremendously powerful light beam at the spacecraft. In minutes, the laser will accelerate the nanocraft to a fifth the speed of light, so it can make the 26 million mile trip in 20 years. It'll be a dangerous journey, so the project eventually will launch hundreds of inexpensive ships, because many will likely fail on the way. Once the nanocraft arrives at one of Alpha Centauri's three suns, it won't slow down, but it'll gather as much data as possible as it whizzes past the stars and planets. With a laser beam of its own, the nanocraft will fire that data back to Earth. Its job is done. But other nanocraft could follow in its footsteps to other nearby stars like Bernard's star, Tau Ceti, and Trappist-1. It's not going to be easy, but it looks possible. We assembled when we started this uh, about 30 of the world's experts in this, and their first reaction was skeptical. They said, you know, they enumerated probably 25 big challenges. But we started looking at them. Each one of them is solvable in the next, uh, next couple decades. This is the century that will leave our solar system and become a galactic species.